Hey everyone, uh, back again. Um, figured I'd show you what you need to do to remove the uh, uh, temperature board out of the Hako FM 203. Um, so you're going to have a zip tie here, as you've seen in the last video. You'll clip that zip tie. Your uh, sleep wires, just move those aside. You'll have your ground wire. Got one screw to the chassis there. Then you'll have four screws. One, two, three, four. And you'll remove those. I'm not sure uh, what the service intervals uh, that Hako recommends for replacing the heat sink compound. Um, but after those four screws are removed, I like to come in from behind because it's got a little divot. Just remove the clip on the voltage regulator. That one's on there pretty tight. Oop, don't forget to remove the transformer plug. Let's see in here. There you go. Come in from behind. And yeah. That's a bit dry. But for thermal paste, we've got a few options. I have used this HY510. You can get this off Amazon for really super cheap. Um, I've also used the Ceramic 2. You can use that. I prefer the Nikosha. Um, that seems to give a lot cooler performance, or a lot better performance. But I'll give this a clean up. Uh, I will clean up that transformer, give it a little bit of uh, anti-corrosion stuff on it, and reassemble it. But it should be good to go for another few years. Uh, hope that helps y'all. Reassemble in the uh, reverse order.